If you're traveling to a new city or visiting a place for the first time, you must know how to ask about an address or give directions in English. Today you will learn so many simple ways to talk about directions. First, I want to tell you so many fabulous vocabularies when you want to talk about directions. And then you will learn many phrases and expressions when you are talking about an address in English. And then you will learn many questions for asking about an address and places. Don't forget to stay up until the end because we want to practice the lesson together. So if you don't want to be lost in a new place, watch this video up until the end. Now without further ado, do, let's watch it, learn it. Okay guys, first let's learn some new vocabularies that you must know if you want to learn new expressions. You ready? Let's go. The first one is roundabout, roundabout, junction, junction. Then we have T-junction, T-junction. As you can see, it is like a T, so we can say T-junction. The next place is zebra crossing, zebra crossing. The next one is sidewalk, sidewalk. You can see sidewalks on both sides of a road and people can walk on them anytime. Then we have alley, alley. Alley is like a narrow passage. Then we have boulevard, boulevard. Highway, highway. You know, highway kind of joins other cities and towns together. The next one is tunnel, tunnel. Of course, you know the next word, it is bridge, bridge. The next word is so much useful, it is corner, corner. It is kind of a place where two different sides meet. Then we have traffic lights, traffic lights. Now it's time to start the main part of this video. We want to learn fabulous expressions to ask about directions. The first one is go straight, go straight. Well, by saying go straight, you mean to continue walking or driving on the same way and without changing the direction. For an example, go straight on main street. Then we have turn left, turn left. And on the other side we have turn right, turn right. For an example, turn left on the corner or turn right at the supermarket. The next one is cross, cross. And as you definitely know, when you can see a zebra crossing, you can cross the street. For an example, cross the street and you will see the bus station. And the next one is make a U-turn, make a U-turn. If you look at the picture, the meaning is so clear and obvious. When you make a U-turn, you completely change your direction. For an example, you don't have to drive fast when you want to make a U-turn. The next one is pass. Pass. Actually, when you are passing something, you keep moving forward and leave that thing behind. As you can see, this yellow car is passing the hospital. For an example, go past the hospital and you will find the cinema. The next one is go through, go through. Actually, when someone says go through something, you need to keep going straight. And the last common phrase is at the roundabout, take the first exit. As you know, roundabouts have got four different exits. And when you're in a straight, you can say that this is the first exit second and third all right guys now it's time for some fabulous prepositions that you can use to give directions okie dokie the first one is between between the second one on the corner on the corner and as you may know a corner is a place like an edge where two different sides meet the third one is in front of in front of then we have behind behind and the last but not least is next to next to let's finish the video with some common and useful questions that you need if you want to ask about a new location 
Okay, here they are. The first question you can say, what is the best way to get to the hospital? Or could you tell me where the library is? The third one, where is the church? Also, you can say, where can I find the nearest shopping mall? And the last one, you can ask, do you know where the bus station is? Okay, guys, it's practice time. Let's practice this lesson together. The first practice is, how can I find the shopping mall? Well, you have five seconds to tell me the correct answer. Well done, you can say go straight, turn left and take the first exit and you will find the shopping mall. What about the second one? How can I find the police station? Excellent, you can say go straight, turn left and cross the bridge, then you can find the police station. Okay guys, now it's your turn. Do you know where the cafe is? Tell me your answer in the comments, I will wait for you. Alright guys, that was it for today's video. If this video was useful for you, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that bell button so you will get notified every time I post a new lesson. If you have other more questions, you can ask me in the comments. I will definitely read all of your feedbacks and answer your questions. So yeah, that was it for today's video. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Bye. Have a nice day.